TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials down 24. NASDAQ is down 12. You get the S&Ps down 350. Gold contracts up uh, $20, trading at 1000 270, 277. Bottom line, you, you get over the highs. It has the volume. It has the juice behind it. Gold wants higher price. Silver. Silver's up 51 cents, trading at $15.65. That's going after the October swing high. I expect, uh, you know, you're going to see a lot of conviction in that move out here today. Platinum. Platinum's up $21 at $9.70. You have copper up another three pennies at $2.23 a pound. Light sweet crude's flat at $34.66. Bonds, we have the 10-year note down three ticks. The 30-year bond off 20 ticks. Now, both of those folks are building costs for, high, for lower price. You had the jobs numbers come out, good jobs numbers. Bottom line, those bonds, those notes want lower price. King Dollar, King Dollar just can't handle higher price. It's pretty amazing actually watching King Dollar. King Dollar was up this morning about 300 ticks. It's down 529 ticks right now, trading at 97.01. You get the euro up 78 at 110, and we get the uh, yen trading at 113.25. We go over and we take a look at the S&P. This is what you have. You got markets that are red right now. I don't expect they're going to stay red. Why? Because what you have is this, is that it was very subtle, but what you actually had inside the indices yesterday is that you had an expansion of volume. The SPY right now is trading at 199.31. You've reached 200.15. Uh, bottom line is that uh, that was the original benchmark. That's the low of December 18th. Well, it's 199.83, but this market, folks, wants to get into that gap, which is 203.87. You've done 21 million shares thus far on the uh, SPY. That's good volume when you're talking about 35 minutes into the marketplace out here. We go take a look at the uh, NDX 100. What do you have with the NDX 100? With the NDX 100 right now, we are down 49 cents at 105.16. Bottom line is that that's hanging right at the highs. Uh, the NDX 100, the three Qs, wants to get into 109.83. Gold, what do we have at gold? Highly volatile. Bottom line, today what we did is that we, uh, the jobs numbers come out, you get down to 12.50. We're trading at 12.78 right now. Uh, last high out here was at a price point of the uh, 1263. It was 1263.90. That was generated on the 11th of February, you can expect high volatility to continue inside the uh, gold market with higher prices continuing at us. We go look at the bond market. We go to take a look at the 10-year first. What you have with the 10-year is this. 10-year bond right now is trading out. It's just basically flat. Uh, we've done 894,000 contracts. You've had a low out here today of uh, 129.21. We're trading at 129.16. You get a big expansion of volume as you're going to lower price. Bonds want lower price. King dollar. The, the move on king dollar, folks, goes like this. King dollar looks like it's going to do a very large ABC structure on the way down. You pull this baby up, and what you're going to see is that we went up Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, dramatically lighter volume. Well, guess what? Volume is blowing out of this right now. You get 24,000 contracts. That's after making a high on Monday. It's 19,000 contracts for the whole day. We've done 24. This will end up doing 40, 50,000 contracts. The King Dollar first move down, 95.28. Larger move down into the 93 area. The 93 area, folks, is the August 24th high volume swing low. So looking at these markets out here right now, what I'm expecting you're going to see is this. You're going to see bonds lower. You're going to see the S&Ps higher. You're going to see the dollar lower and high volatility in the gold market, but you're going to have higher price. This is going to end up closing over that 1263. Right now we're 1277. I suspect you're going to be over that 1263 at the daily close, weekly close. Of course, the XAU, the HUI, they are moving and they are moving with conviction, topside. This 10 a.m. This 10 a.m. update is brought to you each and every day by Evan Bank. For more information on the products they offer, you can give them a call at 855-750-4051. That's 855-750-4051. Have a great day. Have a safe day. Look forward to speaking to you right back here, 10 o'clock Monday morning.
Today, it's hard to tell if the economy is coming or going. Regardless, I want my money going in the direction I choose. If that's your stance as well, then you want to know how EverBank can help keep your money thriving just the way you want. Is growing your money a priority? EverBank is committed to a yield pledge promise to pay high yields on your checking, money market, and CD balances. Looking to diversify? EverBank ingeniously developed accessible ways to spread your money around the world into foreign currencies and even non-FDIC insured metals. And when it comes to your wealth, they bring a highly experienced and global perspective to help you manage it. EverBank's financial philosophy flies in the face of the status quo. They believe your money's performance should not be determined by today's economic circumstances, but by the drive to rise above them and create opportunities that favor your objectives. If that excites you like it does me, call 1-855-750-4051 to find out what they can do for you. That's 1-855-750-4051. Call them today. EverBank is a member FDIC and Equal Housing Lender.